Hey, welcome to this video. And if you arrived here, you're probably searching for proofreading services uh, review. So I'll go over how it works and then I'll give you my two cents, uh, whether I think it's a good use of your time or not. And so uh, what you're going to want to do is come to this page, uh, proofreadingservices.com slash, slash pages slash careers. And uh, because you're here because you want to you want to be a proofreader, not you're not a business owner, right? Now, uh, now you'd be doing all kinds of work for, you know, everything from authors to businesses to academics and uh, and offers they offer part time work as well as full time work. And you can work from anywhere around the world. Now, typical pay is between uh, $19 and $46 an hour. It uh, just depends on the complexity of the job. And you will have to take a 20 minute preliminary test. Uh, but don't let that freak you out. I went through it and it's it's not uh, super difficult. If you are a native English speaker, but if you're not, then it then it might be a little difficult. So it'll ask you questions uh, like, uh, you, you know, uh, are versus is, you know, singular versus plural, and and just basically filling in the blanks. But it, I mean, there are a couple tricky ones, but you, you only have to score 95%. So if you make an error, uh, it's not a big deal. And and plus you can just Google the answers, honestly, because you have 20 minutes and it's it's not that many questions. So and uh and you can also write down what experience you have with proofreading. So that that would help as well. You have some experience, but you don't necessarily need experience. Uh, you can also you can just check none, none of the above. So yeah, they're a completely legitimate website. I should have started off with that. Uh so they've uh, proofreading services. Um, actually, uh, places like Cambridge, Harvard, uh, Cisco uh, have actually uh, hired translators or sorry proofreaders from this website. So you can definitely trust them. And they've been around for a while. So and and as far as the reviews from uh, proofreaders who've actually used the site to make money, to be honest, I could only find one review. And, and basically what they said was um, they've been doing it for a while now and they're very happy with, with the pay and the work. So um, a lot of reviews from uh, business owners saying, um, you know, they're happy with the service. It got delivered in a timely manner, very cost effective and things like that. But uh, unfortunately, I couldn't find many reviews from actual proofreaders, but I, I do believe it's a legitimate website, so you can't really fake this sort of thing. Now, uh, so if you decided you want to go ahead and be a proofreader, it's definitely worth uh, looking into. The only thing I would say about, you know, this, I'm not picking on proofreading services, just these sort of websites in general. Um, I've, I've reviewed dozens of these, and what I found, the work can be quite sporadic. So even if you're making decent money, like, you know, $30 per hour, it's usually not, uh, it's very unlikely to get like a full-time gig, like, you know, eight hours a day, uh, because there's a lot more proofreaders on these websites than actual uh, jobs. So, so it's very competitive. And so if you want to make, a, you know, a couple hundred bucks a month uh, on the side, uh, go ahead, but if you're looking to replace your full-time income, um, I, I it's I think it's going to be an uphill battle. So that's all I would say. Uh, now, look, maybe you're here. You're not necessarily sold on uh, proofreading. Maybe you're just here because you want a reliable way to make money online. Uh, you, you understand the internet's here to stay, and you want a piece of that internet pie, and. Uh, so, well, I was in your position a little over a year ago. I tried all sorts of uh, different ways to make money online. I tried uh, freelancing. Uh, not, I was never a proofreader, but um, I tried freelancing on websites like Fiverr and Upwork. You might have heard of them. And I couldn't get any paying clients to save my life. <laughs> so, uh, so, yeah, it was very difficult. And even though I had a fairly in-demand skill. Now, uh, I tried domain flipping, right? That was a complete waste of time. I tried blogging, uh, you know, writing 2,000 word blog articles every day. 
you know, so you can rank in Google. And uh, and yeah, I, I did that for three to four months, but I, I didn't, I got a, like, I think I got five visitors, five real visitors uh, that the whole three to four months. And I just gave up basically because it wasn't really worth my time. And uh, because the thing is, you're trying to game Google Google's algorithm, so and it's very difficult to do that. And the only business model, uh, and I, I've looked, I've researched tons of other business models like drop shipping, e-commerce, MLM, crypto. Well, it's not really a business model, but uh, you know, creating your own courses, you name it, I've tried it or I've at least researched it. So, you know, filling out surveys, right, <laughs> making pennies on the dollar. Uh, but the only, the only, uh, business model that really makes sense to me and that that's been working is something called affiliate marketing. Now you may have heard of it. It, it is growing in popularity, uh, but, but it's actually, a it's a $12 billion industry. So it's bigger than retail, uh, you know, uh, you know, uh, security and real estate, believe it or not. And and so basically what it is, you're promoting other people's digital products in exchange for a commission. And it can be in any niche. You can go into, uh, you know, the weight loss niche, the make money online niche, the how to build a potato gun niche, how to improve your credit score, how to, you know, jump higher, sing better, uh, play the piano. It, there's countless niches that you go into. And what's great about it, I'll just give you four reasons. So number one, it's very simple. There aren't too many moving parts to it. Um, you, you don't have to create your own products or handle customer service. You're just sort of the middleman. So uh, second reason is the profit margins are around 50 to 80%. I don't know any other business model that has profit margins that high. Thirdly, the uh, there's a lot of automation in place. So you use different uh, software um, that that basically creates a lot of leverage. So you don't necessarily have to be there all the time. And lastly, it's the one business model I found where you can truly be a solopreneur. So you can just be one guy or woman on a laptop, uh, making really good money for my uh, for yourself. And if you're into proofreading, that that probably appeals to you a lot. Uh, Maybe maybe you're sort of introverted and and you like to work alone. You don't you don't like collaborating with people. I was the same way, and affiliate marketing is a perfect fit uh, for that type of personality for sure. And uh, so yeah, those are just four of the reasons I could go on, but uh, I think that covers it. Now, if if, you, if you'd like to learn how to do affiliate marketing the right way, what I suggest is click that link below. You'll get access to a free four day training series. It's actually done by my mentor, the guy who, who taught me all this stuff. And you'll be learning how to, you know, pick a great product uh, that can maximize your revenue. How to, uh, you know, build out a simple sales process that can uh, work for you 24-7 on autopilot. Again, that automation. And how to generate a steady flow of leads into your business every day so your well never goes dry. Because uh, so, with affiliate marketing, there's a lot of bad information out there, and that's why I partly why I failed at it for the longest time. But uh, with this training, you'll get the good stuff. So, and uh, sorry, just looking down at my notes because I don't want to miss anything. And yeah, one last thing I should mention: uh, another great thing about affiliate marketing is uh, it really forces you to just focus on and learn the fundamentals of online marketing. And uh, so, for example, if you want to, in the future, uh, start your own uh, proofreading business or maybe create your own proofreading course or maybe you have some other uh, niche you're passionate about, uh, you, you could do that uh, because, because the thing is you could have the best product or service in the world but if, if you don't know, if you don't understand marketing, if you don't know how to uh, get a steady flow of leads into your business every day, and also how to follow up with them properly, uh, no one's going to buy from you, right? So, uh, but, I, but I suggest starting with affiliate marketing, because again, the, the four reasons I listed, just, just really the simplicity of it. And yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. I hope you enjoyed this 
review of uh, proofreading services. I I know I, don't, I didn't spend a lot of time talking about it, but there really isn't much to go by. Again, this is a simple page and, uh, you know, one review on Glassdoor. So, uh, but yeah, I hope I hope you got something out of it. I hope to see you on the other side and I hope you have a great day. Bye.